What battle spit you out? The guilty have come for spoils. Was our dignity not enough? You return again to mock our family? To make light of my father's sacrifice? <coughs> Matt Seer! You have no fight with me! Which of the traitor kings sent you? Was it Edmund? Burgred? Allah? I follow the orders of no king, nor will I bow to you. You dare intrude? Stay back! I will What Seda makes you multiply? Now I hold nothing back. If I must take your eyes, I will! I am one, and many. What trickery is this? I've seen such violence before. Are you here for blood? Like all of those wretched others? Speak! Not for yours! Unless you tempt me! Liar! 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 You will join them! All the unkind dead! Now I open the scars of my heart! Seder, you sing troll! Breathe deeply! Watch as I become smoke! And listen as I break your bones! Raise a glass in Odin's hall. Another war begins. <laughs> How is this possible? Now my 
my blood screams! <laughs> a scream! I shall quiet! A greater darkness fuels my rage! Spirit of my father's rage, fill me! Too weak and too wild! We. Enough of this cackling and welching. Let rest your demons. Another tortured soul. Come, you heaven, pay your respects to the great and brave King Lyrion. <coughs> I do not know such a man. He was betrayed and murdered by those who denied his friendship just as you deny him now. <coughs> Hold there! I'm not your enemy. Darkness must reign, and you must fade within it. Do not be taken by a demon goddess. You will join my pile of bones. How can there be so many of you? is lost in the rage you spew. No. No. I am found in the I feel great. with all this. 
Dagger I won from the woman in the swamp. It must go here. I have a dagger from the bark lady. It may go here. Blade I took from the Lady of the Crack. It may fit. Fortune. 
guarded well by his wayward daughters. To see you. Here you are, Hytham. The last of the Order's sigils. You will find King Alfred's among them. King Alfred? Did our poor fellow soldier lead you to his hiding place? He did, for they were one and the same. Our poor fellow soldier of Christ was the Grand Magister of the Order of the Ancients. He turned on his own order. Fascinating. Not turned so much as trampled. His devotion to Christ and what he calls a universal order set him against them from the start. With all sincerity, he loathed the title and the duty he had inherited and wished them destroyed. Wonderful. With his abdication, the last stronghold of the order has been dismantled. All that remain are scraps here and there. And you, Eivor. Now that you have seen our enemy and you understand our cause, I wonder if you would join us. Become a hidden one. Was this your ultimate goal, Hytham? A trial by fire? It is a kind offer, but I do not believe we fight for quite the same cause. Your creed demands that you keep your triumphs hidden. I prefer my glory to be in plain view for all to see. If I taught you our creed, if you spent time with it, it could open your mind to another view. Another view is always welcome, but to live without celebrating one's glory and honor and achievements it's not a life for me. But know this. I would give my life in a moment for those I love and who love me in return. All here. Including you, my friend. I understand you well, Eivor. Very well indeed.